Yo, 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 what's going on, everybody? How you doing? You know who this is, the chosen one, Gabriel Skywalker from the DFS Club. Coming to you guys with the NFL Thursday night football edition. Hey, it's not the best game in the world, but you know what? Listen here, Jack. There's money to be made on every single showdown. So we're going to play it. If you guys are new, welcome. Welcome to fun. Welcome to entertainment. And most importantly, welcome to Fire Picks. Again, my name is Gabriel Skywalker. If you could hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Um, leave me a comment down below. I'm really trying to get to 7,000 by the end of the month. Um, and I can't do it without you guys. And there is some incentive. So if we get to 100 comments and 100 likes, I'm giving away a free one-month DFS club membership, guys. That's it. Now, without further ado, let's start the fucking show. All right, there we go. Now we got the right. We, we hit him with the outro instead of the, instead of the intro. Like, Schroeder's over here, like, John, I don't know what's up with him. Man. <laughs> it's, we normally film at night, so I think Schroeder, this is his, his sleep time. So he might drop in. We'll see. Um, Yeah, guys, so we missed the last video. It was a baseball video. So those are kind of tough to hit the 100 comments, 100 likes. But, but. One of our DFS club members, Mr. Jim Parrish, saved the day. This man did so many super thanks on this one video. I'm like, you know what? We got to give away. We got to give away a free membership, guys. Now, if you want to throw a couple dollars in the tip jar, click down below. There's a heart that says thanks next to it. It's a super thanks. Um, if you want to throw a couple bucks, Schroeder in my way. That'd be really appreciated. Um, what was I going to say? Goes towards his baby's mama's fun, his salmon treat fun. Uh, very appreciated, but uh, definitely, definitely not necessary. Um, I'll still bring the videos no matter what, but your guys' kindness really just uh, keeps me going, man. It keeps the channel going, keeps everything going. So let's shout out last video. So, Mr. Pear, Mr. So, you guys can thank Mr. Jim Parrish here for the giveaways this week because, or for today, because. He dropped a fifty dollar uh, super thanks here. He just said thanks. He told me that uh, Mr. Parrish told me he went to Tahoe. He actually went to my spot in Tahoe. I'm about four hours away from Tahoe. Uh, played over there at uh, I think it was Harris. Yeah, I think it was Harris. Won 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 some money, so he thought he'd pay it forward. So thank you so much, Mr. Parrish, for the fifty dollar super thanks. And I know there's a lot more you put in here too, which we'll get to. But God bless you, brother. I know you love muscle cars. Go out and get you get you one of them new Corvettes, man. Thank you so much for the fifty dollar super thanks, man. That is more than generous. God bless you, dude. So thank you so much, Demetrius Gorham, with a two dollar super thanks. As Bolden was my pump play, but great call. MLB, NBA, NHL, Schroeder, Vegas Strip Club, Crawl. Let's ride. Always go. Guardos. Yes, sir. So we're we're gonna do a DFS club uh Vegas trip. That's my dream. So shout out to Demetrius. Thank you so much for the two dollar super thanks, bro. Really appreciate it. It goes a long way, man. Then the rest is all Mr. Parrish. Five dollar super thanks, Mr. Parrish. So that's fifty five dollars. Mr. Parrish, ten dollar super thanks, sixty five dollars, another ten dollar super thanks, seventy five dollars. So as you guys can see how generous Mr. Parrish was, thank you so much, dude. Um, it's been an honor and a pleasure to have you as a family member in the club and as a friend, man. Thank you so much. Um, and because of Mr. Parrish, guess what, guys? We're going to give away a free one-month DFS club subscription, even though we missed the mark of 100 uh, likes and comments. We missed both. But again, it, it's an it's a MLB video this time of year, so they're kind of hard to hit. So, but let's do it, guys. Let's give it away. So, again, down below, if you want to qualify, um, put not a member. I forgot to mention that. Put not a member next. You can comment anything, but if you want to qualify for the giveaway, put not a member, all right, and you will qualify for the next drawing. If this video hits 100 likes, 
and 100 comments. All right, here we go. Drum roll, please. Where's Schroeder at? I don't know. Come on, Schroeder. Let's do it, man. I need your help. All right, so who's it going to be? Good luck to you guys. See if we can get on the first try. Chad says, thanks for the help. You are very welcome, Chad. Very welcome. Thanks for the comment, dude. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go, Mr. Parrish. Mr. Parrish. All right. Brad says, MLB is one tough season. Thanks to my DFS family to back me up on the tricky ones. Yes, you, you are very welcome, Brad. This DFS club, guys, if you're not a member yet, like, what do, what are we doing here? What are we doing here? But I'm going to show you guys how we can do it once we get out of Mr. Parrish's uh, giveaway here. This is sponsored by um, Mr. Parrish. Not by me. This is Mr. Parrish. Let's get this bread as usual. Good video, man. See, a lot of people didn't didn't comment. Um, not a member. Chat again. What are the odds? What are the odds? No sleep. All the DFS club members at. See, we got one. We got one. Skid, like Skid Row, a, a hair metal band. Congratulations, Skid. You are. The winner of a one-month DFS club membership. Congratulations, dude. Sponsored by Mr. Mr. Parrish. All you got to do is email me, skywalkerdfs at gmail.com to claim that one-month DFS club membership, man. Congratulations, Skid. If you didn't win, keep trying. Every video that gets 100 likes and 100 subs, uh, 100 subs, I wish, 100 likes and 100 comments, we're going to do it every single night, just like she said. So... Keep them comments coming, guys. And remember, put not a member to qualify for the next one. And I do videos every damn day. So congratulations. You know what it is, guys. If you want to join the DFS club, we're playing NHL right now as we speak. We're playing NBA right now as we speak. We're playing MLB right now as we speak, guys. 14 bucks a month for every single sport. Go to DFSclub.com. Hell, look at our slideshow here. We got people winning six figures on the daily guys come on now we're only 14 dollars a month this will pay for itself in one freaking day you can't make this shit up I'm checking my hockey store now i'm just the slate just started and we're already killing it we're already killing it you got two providers of one dfs space my brother from another mother myself skywalker dfs guys we're at 700 members if we weren't winning people money trust me we would not have 700 members so you get every single sport. We have them all listed here. If DK offers a contest or, or Fandle, we cover it. Trust me. Click join now. Make sure you click on my logo, Skywalker DFS, so Schroeder and I get credit. And then, as you can see, our plans here, guys. Again, our yearly plan is cheaper than everybody else's monthly plan, and they only give you one sport because they ain't shit. Telling you guys, stop losing. Start winning. Don't you dare be sour no more. Come join the DFS club and feel the power. We got prize picks, sports wagering, you name it. We got it, guys. Our prices, our reputations, our Armani suits, our Rolls Royces, our limousines, our private jets, our private helicopters. We got the most beautiful girl women in the world. Our female members have the, the most tall, dark, handsome men in the world dfsclub.com guys hold on let me go get my rolex shit <laughs> but no seriously guys dfsclub.com 14 bucks a month you cannot find a better deal anywhere that i promise you all right so let's get into the slate man here's where i'm gonna attack it let's just go we'll bring up draft dashboard here okay let's make sure i got i got way too many freaking uh Oh, look at MLB. I'm in first place right now. Isn't that beautiful? Nice. First place right now out of 2,681. So I'm shooting this as, as, um, let me bring up draft dashboard here as we're filming. And I'm looking up, I'm checking my scores too, guys, because, you know, got to make sure we're on top of it. So let's look at quarterback here. We got Washington at Chicago. I know, guys. I know. I don't pick the games, but you know what? There's money to be made. Let's face it. Carson Wentz versus Justin Fields here at quarterback. Carson Wentz is 10-6. Justin Fields is 10-K. 
I think Justin Fields is way overpriced. He should be one of these quarterbacks that are like in the 8,000 range that we get sometimes for a quarterback. Um, Carson Wentz is 10 6. Yeah, Washington's defense is awful. It's completely awful. But the problem is Chicago does not throw the fucking ball. I don't know what Justin Fields hang up is. It's maybe not him. It's, it's probably the coach. It's probably whoever calls the plays. But if I was Fields, man, I'm like, let me throw the fucking ball for fuck's sake. You know, after every play, I, I'd look, I'd look over at the sideline. And I just, in my head, I'd just be like, son of a bitch. Let me throw the, let me throw the ball. Carson Wentz does throw the ball. It's very volatile. Is that is that even a word? Fuck. Yeah, I get I get so excited for these videos, guys. Sometimes I say a lot of times I say words that don't make fucking sense. But 26, 9, 10, 32, 20. So a ceiling game for Wentz, we're looking at a 30 burger. A floor game, we're looking at maybe nine to ten fantasy points. But I think it's worth a shot. Out of the two quarterbacks, I'm going Carson Wentz, hands down, because their price is very similar. Let's go to running backs. Very few running backs to pick from here. However, David Montgomery makes a great captain this week. Love David Montgomery in the captain spot at 10.4K. All Chicago does is run, 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 run. Pound the ball, run it. Pound the ball, run it. Um, So David Montgomery should get tons of carries, man. He's fully healthy now. Um, He should be good to go. He's coming off an injury. It was Khalil Herbert time there for a minute. When Khalil Herbert was in there, he was getting 19 to 20 carries a game. So, I mean, unless Wentz has like is doing really good, which would be good for you if you have him, and Washington goes up like 21 nothing. Yeah, maybe you know David Montgomery won't get the uh, production that you'd want, but I don't see that happening. If it does, it does. But I just think he makes a great captain. Out of out of now, we don't know what's going on with this Washington backfield. I love that Brian Robinson's back. This poor kid got carjacked, got shot three times in the leg. Um, they eased him in just like we thought they were. He got nine carries last week, so they're slowly easing him in. The only one I really trust right now would be JD McKissick because of the the sheer, especially on DraftKings, it's PPR point per reception. So he's had look at his targets, guys. This is like a wide receiver here: nine, four, and seven targets. So I like McKissick here out of all the running backs on Washington, and he is the cheapest at 6.4K. So you can't beat that. Give me Montgomery. Give me J.D. McKissick at running backs. And then wide receivers, Dotson's out. Um, So I'm not a big Terry McLaurin believer. I never have been. I think he's one of the most overrated wide receivers in the league. Prove me wrong. Prove me wrong. For as much as they price him up, right? This guy hasn't broken 20. He's, he, he hasn't even broken, what? He broke 15 fantasy points one game this year. But they always price this guy up like he's fucking Jerry Rice. Give me Curtis Samuel here at 8-2. They're very similar in price, but um, I love Curtis Samuel this week. 8.2K. Again, no Dotson. Um, sound like a damn old-ass car you used to drive. But... I'm just not high on Terry McLaurin, man. Um, eight, ten, seven targets in his last three for Samuel. Six, six, and nine, 69 for McLaurin. So Samuel's getting more targets than McLaurin. Curtis Samuel, what do I call him, guys? Cordell Patterson Jr. He does everything from the backfield, from the slot. He'll go deep. So. Definitely my favorite receiver on the whole entire slate. That's what we're looking at here. Curtis Samuel's my favorite wide receiver on the whole slate, guys. I can't make this up. Um, if you had to choose one from Chicago, it'd be Darnell Mooney. Darnell, sorry. Darnell Mooney, 7.6K. Am I going to go St. Brown? No, 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 no. Just give me Mooney. If you got to, if you're going to ro- roster Justin Fields, do you have to roster a, a wide receiver? Probably not because he doesn't throw it. But if he does, Mooney gets five to six targets a game. He's 7.6K. He's not cheap. So I might take a pass there. And let's talk about these value receivers here for Washington. We got Dwami Brown, 5K. I don't like the price tag here. I think it's a little much. 
he had a great game last game. He got in the end zone three fucking two or three times. All right. He only got four targets. So hamper your expectations here. He might go over on tomorrow at 5K, um, but did get 28 fantasy points. But the week before that, he only got two. So I'm going to look at the ownership when I make this decision here. If Dewami Brown's going to be like 50% owned, I'm going to stay the fuck away from him. I, I don't want nothing to do with him. Cam Sims is 1,400. He got two targets, two, two fantasy points last week. So I think Cam Sims might even be a good punt play at 1,400, but Dewami Brown at 5K, let me see where, where the ownership's going to be. If he's lower owned, I'd say under 40%, I might get a share. Um, but anything more than that, I think I just, I think, just fade them. All right, tight ends. So we got we got a backup in at Washington too. By the way, Cole Komet for Chicago five point two k. Just a really safe play, right? You can save money from getting Mooney. You can get Cole Komet. You're getting the same upside. Nine, five, and six DraftKings points. Three and four targets. Twenty three to four targets a game. But five point two k. You're getting a guy. You know. Again, five, six, nine fantasy points. So for five, two, that's not too bad. John Bates should get the lion's share of the receptions for Washington, and he's only 3K. I love the John Bates play. I'm going to have lots of John Bates for Washington tomorrow. Um, you got six targets two weeks ago. You got you had three last week and still got seven fantasy points. Um, so with all the injuries... Let's see if, if it, we got him right here. I just want to see the damn. Uh, so Logan Thomas, yep, he's confirmed out. So yeah, definitely with Logan Thomas out, I mean, Bates, point per dollar wise, looks like probably one of the best plays on the slate, guys, at only 3K. Cole Turner, too, at 200 bucks, man. This kid got three targets last week. He didn't score. He didn't get one catch, but he was targeted three times. It could be one of those slates where a two hundred dollar tight end gets in the end zone for two hundred bucks. So, if it's going to be low scoring, why not take a shot on Cole Turner for two hundred? But then again, I don't see you really having to go out of your way to pay up this week either. So maybe we don't do that, right? Kickers are fully in play here. This is a kicker game, guys. We're back to the kickers being on the optimal this week. I think it's going to be so. Like I said last video, Kelsey would be on the optimal. Patrick Mahomes would be on the optimal. There are certain players you cannot fade. Some you got to take chances on. Like if you took a chance on Jacobs last week, it paid off. It was bad. It was probably a bad play, but the Raiders went up, what, 17 zip? So Jacobs, yeah, it, he, he went off. So you run it back 20 times, I bet Kansas City goes up 21 nothing. But kickers both in play. Out of the two, they're both priced the same. Santos and Sly. Um, could you roster both of them? Sure you could. Sure you could. Absolutely. Santos, 15 last game. Sly, 7. Uh, let's see. Santos had 0 and then 14. So it looks like Santos so far has the higher ceiling this year. But, you know, Sly has yet to break double digits. This could be the game. And then defenses. Both are firmly in play. 4K for the Bears. The Bears. 3-6 for the Commanders. The Commies. That's what they should have named them. They're in Washington, D.C. They should have named themselves the damn Commies. That would have been awesome. Um, both firmly in play, but if, if defense is going to be over-owned this week, I'm going to stay away from them. I'm just going to roster kickers. I don't know if you go defenses and, and kickers here. I'd go one way or the other. Right, you know, kickers. I probably wouldn't roster a defense, vice versa. You're gonna go to defense, probably wouldn't roster a kicker. It looks like you know, the way it's been, kickers have just been where it's at. So, defenses both are firmly in play. Um, should score enough at four and three six K, but I just think there's more upside with these kickers, guys. All right, so let's go to the lineup optimizer. Let's get a couple of examples here. Toronto's up one nothing. Um, Good, nice, very nice, very nice. Okay. Curtis Samuel as a captain, I mean, yeah, that's not bad. Um, first, let's do a Chicago. Well, 
Dave Montgomery, so since it is a running back that you're going to put him at captain in this lineup, you don't have to correlate the running the, the quarterback with him. That's another reason why I like Montgomery as the captain because you don't have to put Fields in with him to correlate. Um, this is one with the Bears D. Give me instead of the Bears D, I have a feeling they're gonna be uh very chalky. So give me the kicker here, Carlos Santos. I still think maybe you take a shot with Wentz because the rest of these Bears, man, it's just like you're getting Fields here at 10K. You're paying too much, right? You guys see where I'm saying? So JD McKissick, like you don't have to like go out of your way to save money on this late. Between the kickers and the defenses and just the lack of talent, like I don't think you do. So Justin Fields, let's say just for for sake, you're doing a, a Chicago stack. Cole Komet looks good. Mooney, Santos, and then you wouldn't be able to fit Wentz. You'd have to go down here to like JD McKissick. I don't know, man. You can do a mix, right? So we'll leave Montgomery in. We can put in Santos here. Santos. Let's put both kickers in. Why not? It, it, it that's that's how it's been, man. Um, where Sly at? There he is. So we got two kickers in here. We can go Carson Wentz. We'll mix it up a little bit. Um, uh, I like Curtis Samuel. And you can go J.D. McKissick, Komet, Dwami Brown, John Bates. I love this price tag for John Bates. Now we're leaving 4K on the table. Can you leave 4K on the table? Absolutely you can. The more you leave on the table, the better chance you have of taking down all by yourself. You're not splitting it a million ways. Like, yeah, on Monday night, we had a lot of takedown winners here in the DFS club, but it was a very common line, and we ended up splitting it with like a million people. But um so to avoid that situation you can take down all by yourself if because no one someone's gonna look at this and go i'm not leaving 4k on the table why not on this game why the hell not right um but then you're like okay well then i'm gonna get rid of curtis samuel and i'm gonna put in justin fields and make a mistake like that right so i don't know this one looks pretty dope to me you got a mixture of both. You got both kickers, but let's say you just want to do one of the kickers. You just want to put Santos in there. You then you can go up to Mooney, which again I think you might be overpaying. JD McKissick looks great, and you're still leaving what twelve hundred on the table. So, you know, I'd mix and match. I would definitely either make take your stand, whatever you think is going to happen. Either pick your uh, kicker and go that way or pick a defense and go that way with your teams guys i pro i wouldn't do both there's no need there's no need to so pick your poison that's all i'm gonna say so that's gonna do it guys again if you want to qualify for that free one month dfs club membership down below in the comments make your comment and then make sure you put not a member and then you have to be a subscriber so make sure you hit that subscribe button guys hit that like button we got to get 100 likes too I know we can do it for these NFL videos um, and not a member. And most, most importantly, if you want to join the DFS club for 14 bucks a month, or you can go to silver gold plan. You can do a three day pass. We're doing amazing things in here, guys. It's just unbelievable. We got tennis going at nighttime. It's like Vegas in here. It's 24 seven non freaking stop. So you're not going to find another, buddy. you're not going to find anyone out there charging 14 bucks a month, offering you every single sport with winners like we have guys you're just not going to find it dfsclub.com click join now make sure you click on my logo so we get credit and then pick your plans guys and that's it and look who decided to join mr johnny come fucking lately schroeder schroeder skywalker so i know you're a little late to the video schroeder so do you have anything you want to say yeah, don't forget the baby mama fund. Oh, so now you just want to show up when it's when it's about you and your baby's mama's fund, huh? Yeah, yeah. I I, I thought I raised you better than that. Down below, guys, if you want to leave us a super thanks, there's a heart with a thanks next to it. There's also a couple bucks in the tip jar. It goes to Schroeder's child support fund. He has 28 babies mamas now, 26 to 28. 
and over 150 something kittens around the bay area so uh we'd really appreciate it and you get a special shout out in the next video and today's dfs club winner sponsored by mr jim Parrish, for being so so how should i put this unselfish in selfish times so thank you mr Parrish. you are the man you're the star of the video for your generous donations and uh what do we say schroeder let's get this bread don't take shit from nobody absolutely nobody schroeder let us get the fuck out of here we'll see you guys in the next one hit subscribe dfs club let's roll schroeder take care guys and hopefully i hit the right fucking button this time <sighs> Son of a bitch!